Hi friends, in this video I'm going to show you how to install Cloud Data Quick Start on your window machine. To install Cloud Data Quick Start on your window machine, you need to go to this site and you need to download the Cloud Data Quick Start zip file. Okay, so I will give this link on my description and along with that you need to install 7zip. To install 7zip you need to go to this website and download 7zip. If you are using Windows 64 then you can download this one and for 32 bits you can download this through this one. Okay and along with that you need to install VirtualBox. To install the VirtualBox you need to go to the virtualbox.org and then go download and this is the latest version VirtualBox 7.0.4 and this is for window host so if you want to install it for older version then go to the older version and then you can select this one also so my virtual box is already 6.1 and i'm going to show you how to install cloud era on 6.1 okay so after i have downloaded this zip file and I have downloaded and installed this 7zip also and I have already installed this virtual box so I'm going to show you how to do the next step so you have to go to new on virtual box and then let it be cloudera you have to give a name and then this is the location where your uh, this virtual box machine will be stored okay by default it is your root directory c drive you can change this directory also you need to go here and you have to choose other location okay so the machine type will be linux and the operating system will be red hat 64 so you might not be getting 64 uh, bit you might be getting 32 bits so what you need to do you have to enable the virtualization settings on your laptop so i will share in another video for that okay so let it be 64 and do next and then i am using 8 gb ram so let me do it around 4000 mb okay i can do up to up to uh, 5000 and then here since we have already existing disk so what we need to do we have to uh, select this one and then go to this button and go to add since i have already downloaded and i have already unzipped the folder so i need to go to that specific location you can see this is the virtual box and this is the file okay so you can see virtual box disk i have to open it and then choose this one and then you need to create okay and next things what you need to do go to settings and then uh, on system make it a processor should be two and then on uh, network make it be bridge only adapter okay and then do okay so what i'm going to do i'm going to start the machine so it will take 10 to 15 minutes you have to wait for 10 to 15 minutes so you can see it is starting Okay, you can just click cancel and make it large. So you have to wait 
up to 10 to 15 minutes so let me pause the video and I will come once uh, it is installed okay hi friends you can see finally Cloudera is installed so to go to the terminal you have to click this icon and you can see the terminal is open you can check the IP okay this is the IP address and you can run some SDFS command SDFS DFS FNLS you can run this okay you can see the directory is listed or you can close this one you can right click here open a terminal and you can do the same IP address and STFS DFS FNLS you can list a directory okay so you can practice all the Hadoop commands so if you want to log in from your putty then you just copy the IP you can see this putty is there 10 dot 0 dot 2 dot 15 okay so I'm trying to log in it might have some problem so let me log in the username is Cloudera the password is Cloudera so it might have some issue so this is a network connection error so to fix this you have to go to my channel MKD mixture and then you will get this video network error connection timeout you have to follow this step okay this five step you need to follow and then you can log in or either you can check this video also okay so in this channel uh, you'll get a lot of Hadoop commands from there you can practice the uh, SDFS command also okay so you need to go to MKD mixture and then you will get this playlist let me go to this playlist you can see Hadoop commands go to playlist and this is the playlist you will get all the Hadoop command from here and you can practice from here okay so friends uh, if you like my video please don't forget to subscribe and if you have any doubt then please mention on the comment box so that I will try to fix it thank you